Hi, I'm Varsha and you're watching this video from JustTutors.com and in this video we are going to learn about ratios and ratios we are going to focus on the topic which says the two quantities can be compared if they are in the same unit. If the units are different then we have to change the unit and we need to make the unit same then only we can find out the ratio of the quantities and the another part that we are going to cover up in this video that is order of the element while finding out the ratio. So as for the question we need to take care of the order of the ratios while solving the questions. So but before moving ahead we are going to try some warm up questions. Here are the questions for you. To try these questions you can pause the video. So basically in this question you need to find the missing number and question number one says 5 centimeter is how many millimeters? So as we all know that 1 centimeter is 10 millimeters, so 5 centimeter is 50 millimeters. And next question says that 52 kilometers is how many meters? So if 1 kilometer is 1000 meters, so 52 kilometer would be 52,000 meters. These are the answers of the question. Now we move ahead to our today's topic which is quantities in same units. So the question says, Amman has two wires. The length of the one wire is 400 centimeter. Need to take care of the unit. And the second is 2 meter. Now we can see that both the wires are given in the different units. So if it is 400 centimeter and 2 meter. So to compare them, first we need to change the unit. Either we can convert 400 centimeter into meter or we can do 2 meter into centimeter. So as we all know that 1 meter is 100 centimeter so 2 meter would be 200 centimeter. So we are going to convert this 2 meter into 200 centimeter which gives us now two lengths with the same unit with the centimeter. Now we need to find the ratio. So to find the ratio what do we need to do? We need to put the one ratio on the top the other at the bottom. This gives us 4 over 2 and this gives us 2 over 1. So the ratio is 2 is 2 1. So this is the ratio. So whenever you have been given with the different units make sure to look at the unit and change the unit into the same before finding the ratio. Else you will come up to find a wrong answer. Now we move ahead and now we are going to learn about the order of the terms because that is also very important. So in this question you have been given with the length as 12 cm and the width as 9 cm. So width is same as the breadth. So the first question says you need to find the ratio of length to breadth. So it is length to breadth so that means length comes first and then the breadth. So length is on the top and the breadth is on the bottom and the length is 12 cm. So 12 over 9 which is 4 over 3 and we can write the ratio as 4 is to 3. Whereas the next question says you need to find the ratio of breadth to length. So that means we need to put the breadth first and then the length. So breadth will come at the top and the length will come at the bottom. So that would be 9 over 12 which is same as 3 quarters and the ratio would be 3 is to 4. So as you can see that as the order of the ratio is changed the answer is also changed. So that means while answering the question make sure you look at these two things properly that in which unit we are working and what is the order of the term being given to us. Now here is a practice question for you. To try this question you can pause the video. So as you can see that we have been given with two different units again so you need to change the unit first and then you need to find the answer. So the answer for the question is this. So you can pat your back as you work really well in finding out the answers of the ratio and you are understanding the concept that which one is the correct order and which unit do we need to work out on it. That's really great. Thank you for watching the video. For more please visit justutors.com.